While cultivating and digging in many farms, land is often disturbed due to the continuous human activity that is perceived to be destructive. With continuous cultivation, the soil too often loses crucial nutrients such as nitrogen which as a result leaves it to become infertile and produce less yields after farming. But some plants however can replace the crucial nutrients especially nitrogen in the soil. For Daisy Zimbe, a once frustrated farmer in Lukwanga, Wakiso district, the nitrogen fixing trees have transformed her farm into very productive land. Zimbe has planted Caliandra, Lucinia, and Sosbania species that produce nitrogen fixation, which is a pattern of nutrient recycling, which has successfully been used in perennial agriculture for years. The trees are especially valuable in subtropical and tropical agro-farming. But how exactly does this process work? I do give those trees to my animals because they add also vitamin to the animals. Then I use the waste from the animals to add it to the soil because as I add it, the waste of the animals to the soil, then the nitrogen, then the waste adds nitrogen to the soil. The trees are legumes and have noodles which release nitrogen into the soil for fertility, self-reliance. The extensive root system stabilizes the soil while constantly growing and atrophying. This process adds organic matter to the soil while creating channels for aeration. But they should not be mixed with other crops in the garden. I do, mostly I do plant them on the terraces because they can also help when it is hard rain. They can also, the roots can also protect the soil from running. So I do plant them on the boundaries because I want to give them to the animals and I want them also to help me the soil, to help me for the soil not to be washed away by the rain. Nitrogen fixing trees or NFTs for short are often deep rooted which allows them to gain access to nutrients in subsoil layers. Their constant leaf drop nourishes soil life which in turn can support more plant life. Some species of NFTs like Lucinia can also provide numerous products and fulfill many functions including food, wind protection, shed, animal fodder, wood for fuel and timber. The seeds of Lucina, you can roast them, then grind them and get out coffee from the seeds of that tree. So the technicians say it is helpful to people who can have what, like pressure. Since Daisy started planting the trees, she agrees there has been an increase in the fertility rates from her produce and this has helped her to more efficiently and effectively manage her land. So where does one get these tree species? It can be also got from government services like NADS. We also NADS programs also give advice. We have also service providers from the NADS. However, a word of warning, NFTs should be used with due care and oversight. Too many nitrogen fixing plants can over nutrify the soil and pollute surrounding ground and surface waters. Most will not thrive in shade or fertile conditions. Because of their ability to thrive under poor conditions, they can easily become weedy. NFTs are an option for fertilizer, but should not be relied on alone. Craig Kadoda, NTV, Ecotalk.